<laughs> oh, sorry about that, but I guess now you're watching part two. <laughs> so, yeah. Gunwells. Oh. If I could only have been here just over half a century ago. Ah. I had to do this on film because I took a film of horses. Does he just want to build a great big bonfire? Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> Freaking cold evening. Yeah, I love sitting around here. Uh, That's awesome. <laughs> we'll probably be back here. <laughs> Okay, a couple more things to see. Here's shell hoist. Drops down into the bathtub below. Now you think these are talking tubes? People filled them all though. I don't know what that one is. There's really not much need for radio when everyone's behind like several feet of concrete. So some of these tubes that I know are electrical conduits, but a lot, there's a lot of quite a bit of them that are just talking tubes. That's possibly one right there. And I was speaking to this. And people would hear me clear around. Coming out of all these other tubes. I don't know how though, after one of these shells go off, everyone on deck would be deaf. I don't know why. It's uh my favorite war stuff seems to be from the world wars. <sighs> and you know what this is, right? It's the last means of defense. At this point, you're killing personnel coming up the hill. And you're telling everybody you're about to be overwhelmed and come firebomb this place. I always wondered how they did those jumping photos. <laughs> Turns out you just jump the same time you press the button. Coming out. My helmet put Velcro on. Do you guys need bicycle helmets? No, thank no. you. Oh, I was going to say there's someone left two of them behind back there. <laughs>
No, they didn't go through here and top all the trees so they could see what they were shooting at back in the day. They had a control, fire control, and another spot where they'd actually tell them which way to point the guns, and they were all dialed in. They knew what they were going to hit just by what direction their barrel was pointing. Uh, submarine came during World War II. Submerged over there, or uh, came up out of the water, I mean, and fired a total of 17 shells. To, what, 16 minutes? <laughs> Peppered the whole area, not a one hit here. Uh, the, no fire was returned. Not only really sure why, but it was a good call either way. They got it. No information. Japanese left, probably saying that the Columbia River was wide open, and there was nothing. No defense. <laughs> uh, if you have a defense, you want them to think you have no defense. If you have no defense, your best defense is to make them think you have a defense. I'm giving away good secrets now, aren't I? Whatever works, in martial arts, karate, karate, kung fu, all that stuff. It's like war, martial. What works for one person works for a fucking army. The art of war it works for a one-on-one -on -one fight. It works on fucking a million-on-million million fight. This place is pretty cool. I want to come back here and camp tonight. <laughs> I probably will. Uh, I probably will. All right, folks, that's a wrap. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Comment. Uh, don't say anything nice about me. Please. Bye.